All right, look. Basically, um, I still believe it was a good idea for them not to put Toby Maguire and your boy Andrew Garfield in that trailer. Like, I thought they would. I thought out their might, but I think they said, you know what? I still feel that they know that. Look, maybe we know, social media knows, but most of the world do not know. But the very... Because look, maybe they're not in it. Maybe Toby Maguire and Andrew Garfield are not in it. But my thing is, when Doc Ock goes to Toby Maguire and says, you're not Peter Parker, it's obvious that, all right, he is, he's literally from that other world, from that other universe, and it's like, where, where, where the hell is Peter? And that must lead to them now... That because if they if put, think about this, if he's ruptured the universe and so forth, and because we saw Sandman, saw Green Goblin, saw Electro, saw Doc Ock, one thousand hundred percent, those guys have to come in as well because I think what these guys are doing, which is what Sony found success with, was into the Spider Verse. Because I'm just trying to I'm, I'm basically, is there a possibility? Is there any realm of possibility of where you could have where they could not be in it because maybe not because maybe he just fights these the, maybe it's like what the trailer says he just fights these villains and then he's, he's going to find a way to get these villains back into their own universe and so forth so that, that could be the thing but i'm like if you've already made the effort of getting alfred molina jimmy fox willem dafoe and so forth bro you might as well get those other, other dudes but my thing though is if they really got Tommy McGuire and Andrew Garfield, look, I don't believe any of these leaked images. How are you able to keep it so quiet? How are you able to keep it so sad? Because do we should we really believe all of these leaked images? I still believe these guys are in it. So, I mean, look, I think this, I mean, bro, every, I, th I think everything, I mean, bro, everything's going to go. Like, by the time you saw it to that end of the trailer, like, bro, because I have my views on how it's a bit too much CGI, too much effects, but the fact of the matter is that Bro, this guy's fighting like three villains. Like, think about this. This Tom Holland dude was struggling to say what's up to freaking um, Miss Mysterio and your boy freaking Vulture. This guy now has to fight a peak goblin, peak dog orc, peak Sandman, and uh, peak e Electro. So he's basically fighting four freaking villains at the same time. I think he's also fighting Doctor Strange as well. So he's pretty much fighting five five guys. So. I don't know how this guy, who's pretty much been Ant Man's BH and a brick for two films, is supposed to say what's up. But um, look, I don't know. Tell me, guys, what you think? Do you think it was a good idea for them to hold back Toby? And I, for me, I feel yes, of, because I think what they did, which is what I said in my in my preview, is they believe that most people don't know, and that would be such a crazy surprise that if you go into cinema and they need to boom, but guys, what if maybe tell me, tell me, tell me what you guys think? Maybe they're not in it. Maybe they're not in it, and maybe all these leaked images are just sort of made up images. Maybe, maybe, just maybe, they because if they're not in it, cool. But that's a pretty big missed opportunity of something that'll be quite special and a crazy thing for some people who are fans of Tim Maguire and me, who are fans of Andrew Garfield, man. But um, yeah, man, um, ish is gonna go down, man. Tell me, guys, what you think about the trailer.